Welcome to The Way, an independent Christian church located in Ocala, Florida. Thank you for joining us for today's devotional from Elder Daryl Reamer. Today's devotion comes from Acts chapter 5, verse 21b through 29. Earlier, that is before these verses, the apostles had healed a man that was lame from birth and had been ordered not to use the name of Jesus anymore. But even after being warned, they were doing many signs and wonders in the name of Jesus. So they were put in the public jail. But during the night, an angel of the Lord opened the gates of the prison and told them to go, stand, and speak to the people. Now reading from Acts chapter 5, verses 21b through 29. Now when the high priest and his associates came, they called the council together, even all the senate of the sons of Israel, and set orders to the prison house for them to be brought. But the officials who came did not find them in the prison, and they returned and reported back, saying, We found the prison house locked quite securely, and the guards standing at the door. But when we had opened up, we found no one inside. Now, when the captain of the temple guard and the chief priests heard this, these words, they were greatly perplexed about them and to what would come of this. But someone came and reported to them, the men who were put in prison are standing in the temple and teaching the people. Then the captain went along with the officers and proceeded to bring them back without violence, for they were afraid of the people that they might be stoned. When they had brought them, they stood them before the council. The high priest questioned them, saying, we gave you strict orders not to continue teaching in the name, and yet you have filled Jerusalem with your teaching and intend to bring this man's blood upon us. But Peter and the apostles answered, We must Obey God rather than men. Peter said, We must obey God rather than men. We are also told to go and tell about Christ and to tell others how Christ has changed our lives. Obey God. Go and tell.